An oil circuit breaker is a high voltage circuit breaker used for switching any separate electric circuits and electric equipment in a power system. It works in normal and emergency modes. Oil is used for arc suppression. It also insulates live parts. There are two types of oil circuit breakers differentiated by their design. They are tank type and low oil content circuit breakers. Tank type circuit breakers consist of inputs, contact and arc suppression systems placed inside a tank filled with oil. Manually or remotely operated single tank circuit breakers are used at voltage ranging from 3 to 20 kV. Automatically or remotely operated three tank ones are used for voltages of 35 kV. The latter also have automatic reclosing function. When the switch is triggered, the contacts of the arc suppression chambers are broken first. At this point, electrical arc appears. Under the influence of high temperature of the arc, the oil quickly evaporates. Its vapors partially decompose, producing hydrogen, ethylene, and methane. A gas bubble with huge pressure is formed within the range of the arc. When the contacts are broken, the arc is suppressed under the influence of quick cooling by gas and oil vapors. Tank type circuit breakers have the following advantages. Their design is simple and their circuit breakability is very high. The disadvantages include the large size, large volume of oil in the tanks as well as the risk of explosion or fire. Low oil content circuit breakers use highly insulating materials such as ceramics to ensure insulation and arc suppression from the ground. Oil is used only to produce gas. Each break in the circuit has a separate chamber with the arc suppressing device. When in diverged position, the movable conduct is situated above the oil level. This increases the dielectric strength of the brake. Two pairs of operating and arc suppressing conducts are used with high rated currents. Operating conducts are situated on the outer side of the circuit breaker. The arc suppressing conducts are inside. By changing the length of the arc suppressing conducts, you can first break the operating conducts without the formation of an arc and then break the arc suppression ones. The advantages of low oil content circuit breakers include the low oil content and the relatively small weight. The disadvantages are as follows. The oil level must be monitored and may be necessary to add some more oil.